An old diner is coming back to Wassa. The place was originally a diner in the 1920s for about 30 years. After that, the building sat vacant and became forgotten for all but one. New Channel 7's Haley Clevenger spoke to the new owner about the place. Haley, what do people have to look forward to? Cassandra, Tyler Vote says this, his plan is almost ready to go, and he believes this place will be unlike any other place in Wassa. Tyler has been waiting to open this new diner ever since he first walked in the building six years ago. And the place had been um, sort of abandoned, and I thought it looked perfect. Um, it had so much potential that I just wanted to do something that would become kind of a center of the community up on the side of town. Because a diner used to call this building home, some of its history remains. We removed all the plaster off the walls, we removed the drop ceiling, we kept a lot of the old booths and the counters that, that had the diner charm. We have an open kitchen concept, also uh, kind of a traditional diner charm. We were able to bring back the original floors. What he really wants to do with this place is bring back in-person conversations. What I'm calling conversation forward sort of atmosphere. Uh, it's a place to strengthen real connections with people, talk to your neighbors, talk to your family, and have some great food while you're here. As West Sider Diner and Lounge gains its footing, Tyler hopes to expand its opportunities. I hope to do some little street festivals out here uh, coming in, in future years. Um, there's a lot of potential here. He hopes to open this place in two weeks. You can find it here on North 3rd Avenue, just off Bridge Street. This place will have classic diner food and, of course, a Wisconsin classic, a fish fry. Live in Wassa, Haley Clevenger, News Channel 7.